Hello, good evening. <laughs> Buenas noches, bienvenidos todos. Welcome to Remembering the Future. We would like to start the evening by acknowledging that the Orpheum Theater is on the unceded and ancestral territories of the Musqueam, Squamish, and Tisleil-Waututh peoples. I'm Lili Vieira de Carvalho, the executive director of the Vancouver Latin American Cultural Center. VLAC is an, an organization with a mandate to share a deeper understanding of Latin American arts. Our goal is to establish a physical space, a cultural center for Latin American arts here in Vancouver. This month, October, is Latin American Heritage Month in Canada. And we celebrate with Latin Expressions, which is a series of events uh, covering all arts disciplines throughout the month. This is the most, uh, like this, this is the highlight of the, the month for us, this concert. But we still have a few other events coming up in the next week. So I encourage you to go to our website, vlac.ca, vlacc.ca. And maybe I can see you again next week in, in, in some of the upcoming uh, events. I want to thank the funders and supporters of, the, of this event, the city of Vancouver, the province of British Columbia, the government of Canada, the Yusef Warren Foundation, the Consulate of Chile, our media sponsors, STIR, 2604, and Global News, and the organizations partnering with us throughout the month to deliver these events, uh, the Vancouver International Film Festival, the Writers Festival, the Dance Center, the Mural Festival, the National Film Board, the Simon Fraser University, and Electric Company Theater. A uh, heartfelt felt thank you to the guys, so the folks here at the, at the theater, at the Orpheum Theater, the crew who is making everything run smoothly. And a big shout out to my staff at VLAG, also our board members and the amazing volunteers that were greeting you, uh, when, you when you get to the theater tonight. A uh, quick reminder, we won't allow photos during the concert or filming, so please hold on that. You can do that on the very last song of the, of the concert, but we don't want to, to break the spell, so just please hold off. We have, photog we have photographers here, and we can catch up on, with the photos on our social media uh, in the coming week. Uh, one important thing, please donate to Vlack. Our organization, we, we try our best to make events like this very accessible. We did this event on a sliding scale where you could pick the price you wanted to pay. And we also donated a lot of tickets to indigenous, underserved communities. So to keep this going, you really need your donation. There are donation, uh, uh, there is a table set for donations just outside the door. So maybe on intermission or, or after the concert, you stop by to, to donate whatever you can. There is also a gift there for you, so don't miss the gift. You get the gift even if you don't donate, so please do stop by there. Now I'd like to introduce you to the Consul General of Chile, Alan Arum, who will say a few words. Thank you, Lily. I'm deeply moved to share with you today. When you work in a diplomatic mission abroad, among your objectives, your aim is to bring a better knowledge of your culture and you make an effort to build partnership and alliances. I'd like to express my admiration for the work carried out by the Vancouver Latin American Cultural Center. We have been collaborating, a natural collaboration, since my arrival to Vancouver one year ago to enhance the understanding of the Chilean arts and culture in Vancouver. And I'm delighted that, that we could join forces to present this concert tonight. Thank you, Carmen Rodriguez, Hugo Guzman, colleagues, consul generals, authorities, and volunteers. I appreciate very much the significant participation of the Chilean, Canadian, in Latin, in Latin American communities and our friends. We are very proud of your presence in this magnificent Orpheum Theater. This year in Chile and around the world, we are commemorating 50 years since the coup. We are doing today by evoking the memory of all the victims of this dark passage in the Chilean history. 
We remember today those who were made disappear and we still don't know the whereabouts of 1,162. We also remember those who suffer imprisonment, persecution, exile, and trauma. And those who slept with the suitcases under the bed for many years ready to go back to Chile. The artistic, the artistic work of this concert will provide us with the necessary moral clarity and full conscience of this violent break of our democratic tradition. This story connects our roots and also plays and will continue to play an important role in the dissemination of Chilean in Latin American culture in Canada. And the essential contribution of the Chileans in Latin American community with music, art, poetry, entrepreneurship, social work, and participation in politics in British Columbia and all around Canada. These communities never, real, never really left their homeland and actively have empowered the development and sustainable growth of these two countries. Therefore, the bond that unites Chile and Canada is stronger today and much more in the future. Thank you all. Thank you, Alan. So now, just help me with a warm welcome to the stage, Suma Lau, and remember in the future. Thank you.
la partida. One of Victor Jara's last compositions. The end and a new departure. Victor Jara, the iconic singer, songwriter, and activist assassinated a few days after the military coup, along with thousands of others. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Bonsoir. Good evening, everyone. And welcome to Remembering the Future. My name is Carmen Rodriguez, and I'm a Chilean-Canadian writer, educator, journalist, and music aficionado. I came to Vancouver in 1974 as a political exile and a refugee, and tonight I'm honored to welcome you all to this momentous and fun event in commemoration of the coup and in celebration of the arrival of Chileans and Latin Americans in Vancouver. I'm here with a composer, multi-instrumentalist, and band director, Hugo Guzman, and with Sumalao. And we're ready to continue with this program of simply wonderful Chilean and Latin American music that we're offering to you tonight. <clears throat> Our next song is also by Victor, by Victor Jara, and it's an urgent call to our continental hero, Ernesto Che Guevara, who in 1967 was being persecuted by the Bolivian dictatorship 
and the CIA, who, in the end, did catch him and executed him on October 9th of that year. This is El Aparecido, the apparition. Thank you. On September 4th, 1970, Salvador Allende is elected president of Chile with a program called The Peaceful Road to Socialism. That evening, millions pour onto the streets to celebrate, and the artists get busy creating work in support of the popular unity government. Canción del Poder Popular, Song to Popular Power. No. 
nosotros los que levantemos Chile, así es que a ponerle el hombro. Vamos a llevar las riendas de todos nuestros asuntos y que de una vez en Thank you. For thousands of years, the Atacama Desert, the driest in, in the world, has been home to llamas, vicuñas, alpacas, flamingos, also a source of human greed and exploitation, wars, and worker struggles. But the Atacama has also fostered wonder, spiritual fulfillment, hope, and memory. Memory of the many civilizations that thrived there, that sang there, that left their mark on the rocks. The Atacama Desert, where the wind whispers and roars and the naked stars dance in the translucent air. Desierto, desert.
Pablo Neruda, Chilean poet, politician, Allende's ambassador to France, 1971 Nobel laureate, and a political exile like us during the late 1940s and early 1950s, when President Gabriel González Videla outlawed the Communist Party of Chile and repressed striking workers. The lyrics of our next song are indeed a Neruda poem, which he wrote back then, but whose words could very well have been written right after the September 11 coup and before his assassination on September 23rd. Pido castigo. I ask for punishment. esta muerte pido castigo pido castigo pido castigo para el traidor que ascendió sobre el crimen para el que dio la orden de agonía para los que defendieron este crimen Pido castigo. Pido castigo. Pido castigo. No quiero que me den la mano empapada con nuestra sangre. Pido castigo. Pido castigo. No los quiero de embajadores, tampoco en su casa, tranquilos. Los quiero ver aquí, juzgados, en esta plaza, en este sitio. Castigo. Washing trough? What's a washing trough got to do with anything? Oh, la batea. Okay. Yes, we Chileans love making light of terrible situations. Yeah. <laughs> you should hear some of the jokes that came out right after the coup while we were literally running for our lives. So, no wonder that musical ensemble Kila Pajun decided to make fun of the junta through music. So here goes satirical La Batea, the washing trough. Se menea, como se menea, como se menea. 
contigo llegarás. Mira la batea, cómo se menea, cómo se menea el agua en la batea. Mira la batea, cómo se menea, cómo se menea el agua en la batea. El cerebro de Gustavo, qué barbaridad. Tu cabeza de pescado, qué fatalidad. El Gustavo. Ea, qué felicidad, la batea, ea, qué barbaridad, se menea, ea, qué felicidad, la batea, ea, qué barbaridad, se menea, ea. <laughs> Did you rob in the batea? Following the coup and during the dictatorship itself, hundreds of thousands of Chileans left the country. We said goodbye to everything we knew and jumped into the void. Here in Vancouver, we were literally caught by supportive organizations and individuals who didn't only provide much needed material assistance, but also love, and as importantly, solidarity with the resistance movement that we were supporting from afar. With the next piece, Hugo's composition, we remember saying farewell to Chile and honor all those who welcomed us here in Canada. Dedicatoria para un adios, dedication to a farewell.
¿Quién me ayudaría a desarmar tu historia antigua y a pedazos volverte a conquistar? Una ciudad quiero tener para todas construido y que alimente a quien la quiera habitar. Santiago, no has querido ser el cerro y tú nunca has conocido el mar ¿Cómo serán ahora tus calles Si te robaron tus noches? En mi ciudad murió Recorreremos tu alegría desde el cerro a tus mejillas y de ahí saldrá un beso a mi ciudad. Santiago, quiero verte enamorado y a tu habitante mostrarte sin temor. En tus calles sentirás mi paso firme. 
Sigo cruzando ríos, andando selvas, amando el sol Cada día sigo sacando espinas de lo profundo del corazón En la noche sigo encendiendo sueños para mirar el humo sagrado Cada recuerdo Cuando escribo tu nombre en la arena blanca con fondo azul Cuando miro el cielo en la forma cruel de una nube gris aparezca tú una alta loma miro al pasado sabrá que no te he olvidado yo te llevo dentro hasta la raíz y por más que crezca vas a estar aquí aunque yo me oculte tras la montaña y encuentre un campo lleno de caña no habrá manera ni rayo de luna que tú te vayas que tú te vayas oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh, 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 oh Pienso 
que cada instante he sobrevivido al caminar y cada segundo de incertidumbre, cada momento de no saber. Son la clave exacta de este tejido que ando cargando bajo la piel. Así te protejo, así sigues dentro. Yo te llevo dentro hasta la raíz y por más que crezca vas a estar aquí. Aunque yo me oculte tras la montaña y encuentre un campo lleno de cañas, no habrá manera ni rayo de luna que tú te vayas, que tú te vayas. Yo te llevo dentro hasta la raíz y por más que crezca vas a estar aquí. Y aunque yo me oculte tras la montaña y encuentre un campo lleno de caña, no habrá manera ni rayo de luna que tú te vayas, que tú te vayas. Oh, 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 Y aunque yo me oculte tras la montaña y encuentre un campo lleno de caña, no habrá manera, cariño mío, que tú, que tú te vayas. The soil, the land, the soil, the land. First stolen from Aboriginal peoples by the conquerors, the colonizers, then divided into huge estates and worked in medieval-like conditions by poor peasants. Latin America has witnessed many land reforms, too many to mention here. But there is one that gave way to our next song, which pays tribute to Venezuelan popular leader José Rafael Montilla, also known as El Tigre de Guaito, who, in the latter part of the 19th century, armed the landless peasants of northwestern Venezuela and succeeded in taking the land from the big landowners and giving it to those who work it. Montilla. Vengo a trobar este golpe que un amigo me contó pa' que mañana no pasa o hagan lo mismo con yo. Vengo a trobar este golpe que un amigo me mandó pa' que mañana lo pasado hagan lo mismo con yo. Ahí viene Montilla a dar la pelea y viene diciendo morena la bala chirrea. Él armó su gente con la artillería y prendió los fuegos morena de la Ave María. Al estado que llegó Montilla, al estado que ha llegado, al estado que llegó Montilla, al estado que ha llegado, al estado que llegó Montilla, al estado que ha llegado. Al estrado en que ha llegado, fue tan valeroso y a Montilla lo han matado. Fue tan valeroso y a Montilla lo han matado. Dicen que Montilla viene, dicen Montilla va. Yo digo que esto es mentira porque yo vengo de allá. Dicen que Montilla viene, dicen que Montilla va. Porque yo vengo de allá Ahí viene Montilla a dar la pelea Y viene diciendo morena, la bala chirrea Que 
The Andean region, the cradle of ancient civilizations that have preserved their languages and culture, their ways of seeing and being in the world in spite of the conquest, colonialism, capitalism, imperialism, and genocide. We carry a spiritual world inside our soul. Brother, believe me, I would like to show it to you, but it's not for sale to mainstream knowledge merchants, says our next song. Hijo del Sol Luminoso, child of the luminous sun. Poderoso, talentoso, 
esa cría soy yo, hermano del africano que llegó de muy lejano y conmigo sufrió. Américo a mí me dicen porque vivo en la altura, la la la, casi al lado del sol, casi al lado del sol. se vende hermano mío a la ciencia oficial
Mike on saxophone solo, beautiful. Well, from coastal Peru all the way to Brazil, please welcome our guest artist, Vancouver based Brazilian singer songwriter Sara Magal. Sonio Meo, dream of mine. Sonho meu, sonho meu Vai buscar quem mora longe Sonho meu, sonho meu Sonho meu Vai buscar quem mora longe Sonho meu Vai buscar essa saudade Sonho meu Com a sua liberdade Sonho meu No meu céu a estrela guia Se perdeu A madrugada fia Só me traz Melancolia Sonho meu Sinto o canto da noite Na boca do vento 
Obrigada, graças. What's that? Oh, in case you were wondering, that's what you see from the moon when you look at Hugo's balcony. <laughs> Mi balcón desde la luna. My balcony from the moon. Not quite like that, but it's okay.
Cambia lo superficial, cambia también lo profundo, cambia el modo de pensar, cambia todo en este mundo. Cambia el clima con los años, cambia el pastor su rebaño, y así como todo cambia, que yo cambie no es extraño. Cambia el sentir un amante Cambio el rumbo, el caminante Aunque esto le cause daño Y así como todo cambia Que yo cambie no es extraño Cambia todo, cambia
Cueca, Cueca is Chile's national dance. And until the time of the coup, it was always danced by couples. But as part of their awareness campaigns, the families of the disappeared began to dance La Cueca Sola, the lonely cueca, or the cueca I dance alone. Before we start saying our goodbyes, here's a last glance at the South through a contemporary cueca by Hugo, Mirando al Sur, looking south. Before we start playing the second to last song, I would like to introduce the members of the band. Without them, this show would be, literally would be impossible. Carmen Rodriguez, vocals. <laughs> Narration. Story. Audiovisual, everything. Far right, Luma Stroiani on grand piano. Besides Lou, Al Johnson on bass. In the percussion section, we have Rolo Presa on congas, cajon, bombo. Chris Dennis on tiple, cajon, bombo, congas. Besides them, Raf Geronimo on drums. We continue on the far. Mike Braverman. Ten of class, a ten of Besides Mike, Jerry Forte on trombone. Besides Jerry, Kevin Jackson, trombone. Oh, no. <laughs> Derry Byrne on trumpet. Derry, right, right, right. <laughs> Besides Derry, Malcolm Aiken, trumpet. <laughs> Working very hard with me in all the arrangements tonight. Then, vocals, Kike Mandiola. Besides Kike, Janier Oliver. Yeah. Yeah. Andre, Steven on guitar. Yeah. Manuel Lara, vocals, charango. And uh, he just went to the, the back by Pamphlet, Kenna, Cuatro. Miguel Vasquez. We played together in Chile. He lives in Toronto. He always comes through for me every concert. Miguel Vasquez. And of course, Hugo Guzman. Give it up for him.
Well, we're going to uh, end the evening with an iconic song by the mother of the Latin American new song movement. Chile's Violeta Parra. She composed this song only a few months before taking her own life at age 50. Thanks to life, she says. Thanks for my eyes, my ears, my words, my feet, my heart. Thanks for the tears and the laughter, which helped me tell sorrow from joy. Gracias a la vida. Thanks to life. Yeah,
llorado tanto me ha dado la risa y me ha dado el llanto así yo distingo dicha de quebranto los dos materiales que forman mi canto y el canto de ustedes que es el mismo canto y el canto de todos que es mi propio canto Gracias a la vida ¿Quieren más? What's, Oy. What's wrong with you guys? It's Sunday night, you have to go home. <laughs> okay. A ver. Se me 
ea, ea, qué felicidad, la batea, ea, qué barbaridad, se menea, ea, qué felicidad, la batea, ea, qué barbaridad, se menea, ea. Thank you, Vilak, Lily, Victor, Angela, Thais, Dana, Hilda, and all the volunteers. And please don't forget, donate to Vilak if you want to keep seeing shows like this. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Cheers.